Hey, welcome back to the Comstock Clan. We're Kevin and Christy. Here at the Comstock Clan, we share ways that we are building our family culture of faith, family, fun, and freedom. And today we have a non-grocery Costco haul to share with you. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Open. <laughs> 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 you went to Costco and didn't get groceries? We did. We we did. We went to we don't go grocery shopping at Costco. We get that all delivered. But we had a rewards check and a gift card and some budgeted funds to spend. And Which was kind of fun. Uh, I kept like thinking, wow, is this normal? Like this we were just, out till after eight o'clock at night. It was a strange, <laughs> it was a strange experience, but um, the weather was great, and it was actually really nice, kind of warm Indian summer, and we had a date at Costco. When we were checking out, I asked, I asked everybody, Kevin and the two checkout clerks, what they thought the total was mm -hmm. going to be. The person that does the checkout and the bagging, and I, were all within fifty dollars of our guests and Christy was $400 more, and it ended up being $300 more than her guests. $300, $300 more, there's more. So. Kevin and the checkout I, we clerks get, were all like around $900. Yep. And when I, I was originally thinking, I'm gonna guess 18, I'm gonna guess 18. And they're all like, yeah, 900 bucks. And I was just like, no way. <laughs> It's way more than yeah, that. Way. But after I heard all their guesses, I dropped my guess way down to $1,200. No, it was 13. You guessed 13. Did I guess 13? You guessed 1300 Okay. So it was like 16 six, It was like 16 80 I think, maybe. So um, there's one fairly large item in there that takes up majority of that expense. Uh, stay tuned, okay. and you shall mm -hmm. see. All right, here we go. We have dog food. This is one of those things that they they add a dollar or more to everything that gets delivered, and so every once in a while we try and do a stock up and get it while we're there in the store. We've also got three bags of cat food back here. The torch flame and the folding lighter and the aim and flame flex. And the aim and flame. So just in case if you burn yourself, we got some band-aids behind there. And these are insanely cheap, but incredibly valued. There are six times. What are you showing? All the different varieties. Oh, there's six times the number of band-aids. And these, so we usually order them online and they're usually $13. In store they were $11. And they're awesome. They're fun. They've got all kinds of different colors. I hope that I've got the, I think I do have the focus on. Yes. Um, yeah, so we love Welly Band-Aids. And, and then just traditional Band-Aids as well. Traditional. And it, it sounds absurd to have this many Band-Aids, but we went through like one of these in a month. Uh, for between, you. For, for myself. For myself. So we don't do a lot of paper products because we just like to use the dishes that we have and we love our dishes, but we do have some paper plates in the background just for those instances where it makes sense to do paper plates or if we just don't feel like doing dishes. But oh, that's not what those are for. That's not what those are for. When we have company. <laughs> <Oops>. No. <laughs> what are those for? Apparently, I don't know. I what that's for. Yes. Okay, let's try that again. Okay. For crafts. Um, if you don't use this paper for anything printing related, do it. It's awesome. It's incredible paper, very reasonable price. Um, but it works. but I've now become a paper snob, and yes. I've gone like even fancier. Yeah. Like it's like it's funny. She gives me my sheets in one type of paper, and she gives her her own sheets in another. And I just go and I'm like. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's so not true. I have asked you. I have said, babe, do you want me to print your paper on the 32 pound sheets? And you say, no. But she asked me in a way that's like, do you really need. Do you really need. The, the fancy paper for you? I mean, it's you. Okay, stop. 
This, they had this little, like, it's a, squeezes on the desk. It's a clip and twist dispenser. And we did our, so we took the kids on Friday. And we walked around Costco and we looked around and they did not have this. They had the regular rolls and they were full price. And we got there on Monday and they had these and they awesome. were like $5 off. Yeah. And you got this free little thing. So we got two. But of them. here's a neat thing. We went yeah, through right. Costco together as a family and just eyeballed and kind of window shopped what we wanted. And then we went back. I took pictures of everything. Yep. We went back as a couple without the kids and had unbelievable focus and were able to make decisions with less distraction. <laughs> so. Well, and most of it, like a lot of the stuff on the table here. We had picked out when we were there with the kids, we had figured out where it was coming out of the budget and we were able to plan for it because I hate impulse buying. And so it worked really well. And then we got some crab, some lobsters. There's no crab. 38 quart pots. Ginormous, it's bigger than my Asher, what are you going to cook in there? Eggs. Eggs. <laughs> Oh, I've yeah. seen yeah. scrambled eggs like oh, this. Oh, yeah, yeah. Use this for Easter. Use this for Easter. Winter Gloves Head brand. I don't know exactly what that is. They are so soft on the inside. Got these so that when I go walking, I have gloves. And they're a little, like, grippy. So these are really nice and comfortable. It's really nice being able to get all the kids, A, new gloves before they need them. And B, actually get everybody set of gloves because, you know, we, we have seven kids and finding we gloves find for everybody. Every size. every size. So it works. We have some stretch tight. And then, yes, we also got parchment paper. Parchment paper. That's a very nice nonstick. There's something fancy about it. Like it's not bleached or something. I believe that it is the same brand that we get from Azure. Um, it is. Which. Paper chef? I. Did not know that Costco had it. Apparently they've had it for a little while. We've always gotten our parchment paper from Azure. It's the best parchment paper ever. Ever. It is. The meal prep set. These are just glass containers that have little silicone things around them with lids. The thing that I like about them is that they're just, they're all the same size. Yes. Now this is one of my favorite parts of going to Costco. I like to get books. And, but these are adorable. Toucan. Toucan. We have so, animal shapes as well. Um, if you go to Costco and you have a few minutes, read Mother Bruce. It's a very, um, I, not it, politically correct, politically correct book. So well, there's a farm, a farm there's and animal, animal adventure. adventures. And, and then, then we got the rocket one because our next unit study is going to be on space. And so I figured this would That's really cool. Really and behind these guys, we got the Smithsonian books. These are depth. the super simple biology, chemistry, and physics. We like to have a number of different um, resource books like that available for the kids to go through and look through have to go and find things that we're learning when we do certain units we'll pull them out and we've got a variety of them so that they can learn from different angles and whatnot yep. and then behind that is a collection of roll doll um, which i just learned kevin has never read a roll doll book before so i'm gonna binge those <laughs> i don't know i'm curious have you read roll doll like did you read roll doll when you were in school before they made all the movies or let us know what you did read because apparently I'm an anomaly. <laughs> All right, next up we got some costumes. Although it's a little much, Breslin is just awesome and she's going to be absolutely adorable in that. And I've always wanted to be a firefighter, so I thought maybe. No, I'm just kidding. We got a five year old. It's not. Um, it's not for his birthday he's or anything. Not, he's not five yet. He's gonna be five in a couple of days. But he saw this the other day when we were at Costco. It was like, Dad, they have a firefighter costume for right. me. Both of you, um, close your he's eyes. Freak out. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Open. Open. <laughs> 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 Easy. 
Zayden. Oh gosh, you guys. Uh, underneath the costumes, we got a couple bins. We love everything organized as possible. She's got a thing for bins, bags, and baskets. And we use those bins specifically for, for books. books. Yeah. The one thing I love about them is that they are the most like straight sided bins. So they work well for books. Most bins are like they, they, kinda, they cave they in. Get, yeah. But the great thing is you can stack them up. Yes. Four, four high. You don't jeopardize the structure on it at all, which is really exciting. Next, we have the just a rug. It's nothing fancy. The 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 rugs have always been kind of a point of contention because the rugs we have are about two feet too wide. So you have to fold them over. Well, so these will fit there quite nicely. Uh, for the first time in the Comstock Clown House, I've always wanted to try the WeatherTech floor mats. I remember when they came out a handful of years ago. I mentioned to Christy that I wanted them. She's like, no. And I personally like carpet mats. She likes carpet yeah. mats. But the neat thing is, is WeatherTech has made it incredibly affordable for anybody to get them. They have these new kind of universal style. You just cut them to fit. I'm pretty excited about it. 40, or 30, 20, 30 bucks. 20, yeah. 20, 20, 20 29, 99. Just a rug to go on the outside of the house so that if you do need to run in with your shoes on, you can, you can clean off. your shoes off quickly. And then this will get, um, we'll just add this as like a weekly chore for the kids to hose them off weekly to keep them clean and green, but black. Yeah. <laughs> we grabbed a bag of sugar while we were at Costco. We use the just pure cane Costco sugar for feeding our bees and the hummingbirds when they're in season. And I figure I'll, we'll probably just continue to buy it through the winter because we won't be feeding either of them through the winter. But but it'll be really good just to build up a stock of it. And Because we're going to get more bees next year. Yes. And we don't know if it'll always be available. We also have a beehive setting up video. If you haven't seen that, we can link that below. That was absolutely a blast. We get our bird seed to feed our wild birds from two places, actually. Costco and Chewy. At our old house, we did not have as many birds as we do here, and I've oh. been getting more consistent with feeding them, and there's been way more variety of birds. We actually have blue jays and scrub jays here, which we didn't have at our old house, and there's probably like 30 or 40 of them out there in the morning, of like all, all the different types of jays that are out there. They just love like the black oil sunflower seeds and the corn and this variety has a whole bunch of things in it that tracks the jays and finches and juncos and it's just like a perfect bird variety. There you go babe! Apparently I'm on trash duty. <laughs> um, super clean, simple, easy. <laughs> <laughs> I opened it. Easy open. <laughs> <laughs> but um, they fit our trash bag easy, or our box easy and we empty it sometimes three times a day because we have a small trash can and I, I love these. They're awesome. And there's 200 so that lasts us like three weeks. <clears throat> Next we have... Da, 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 da. Dry uh, erase boards. Yay! We actually have two of them. They have this. They had a couple different trims. They had black, brown, and like, like a, a cream antique white. white. Yep. What really got me is the other day, Breslin comes into my office and she pulls out, I've got little pouches that have dry erase markers in them, and she pulls them out and she's like, Mommy, when can I color with these? Yeah. And I tell her, like, you can't color on paper, you have to color on dry erase boards. Well, anyway, and Something. so I said, go ask Daddy to get you one of the dry erase boards and clean it up because it's in the garage. And he did. So we got two of these that dad, are gonna go. Best dad award goes <laughs> to me. All right, so then this is the fun purchase that we're all really excited about. I'm gonna use it first. No, we, I am. We purchased our first Vitamix. So I think like 15 years ago. You can only get this when they do the road show. This specific model, it's got the self-clean, gives you a back massage Wait, kind of thing. I'm not sure exactly what it does. You can hook it up to your phone. It'll do cycles. It'll do everything. And 
Vitamix has a 10 year warranty. Costco has you can return whatever you want policy. And so between those two things, like we try and make most large purchases through Costco for those reasons. This is a special attachment. Atta like it's well, it's the actual um, blender part. Don't What's it called? It. You can't really like the right pitcher. There. It's the pitcher part. And what the lady did when we were there was she took she made mojitos, a lime, and she <laughs> sliced it, and she threw the lime into the water, and she threw some agave nectar in there. So I didn't try it, but. I'm excited to make it just without any sweetener and uh -huh. just use it to do like, I mean, we can throw lemons Lemon, or limes ginger. or grapefruit, no, ginger, ginger. Yes. grapefruit. It's, it's got this aerator in it and I guess it's something like what Starbucks uses to do their like frothy drinks. It, it, what it did, we she took, she took really stuff. thinly sliced limes that were maybe a, a three eighths of an, not even three eighths, like a, uh, an eighth of an inch thick sliced and she threw it in here but it emulsified them, but it remained intact. And yeah. it just got all of the, she listed off like 18 different ingredients that came out of the lime. I'm not sure how that happened. Crazy. Um, but we're gonna give it a go. One of the things I want to say about our previous Vitamix, one of the gears went out, so it either has zero or 60. There's no in between, so it's like you, you can, you can kind of go, and it goes and it makes a really awful noise. So making smoothies or anything now is gonna be much more pleasant. And I can do it at five o'clock in the morning and not wake up the neighborhood. <laughs> Thank you for joining us on our non-grocery Costco haul. This was a blast, not only as a family going through Costco, kind of navigating through the store, but again, going back as a couple on a date. It wasn't anything fancy or glamorous, but we were able to spend time together, connect, and just continue to build our family culture. We hope that you found this video encouraging for you to decide what type of family culture you want for your family. You can stay tuned and for more on how we build our culture here at the Comstock Clan. <laughs> <laughs> Oh gosh, you guys. What?